Hello everyone, I'm here to do a figure review that a figure I got back in Hobby Lobby ever since, I think 2012 or 2011. And this figure actually came out in 2006, I believe, or 2007. I gotta check a look after the video. But anyways, I'm here to do a review, of course, on the Papo Tyrannosaurus Rex. I have to say that for the time, I really love it a lot. And I even still do because it's like the original, like, it was like my very first or one of my first non-Jurassic Park toys. Even though, of course, that this Papo, uh, well, back in the day, Papo specifically did figures that were based on Jurassic Park. And this, of course, was one of them. I mean, even if you look at the keratin on its, like, eyes, the bump on its nose, and and even the arms, it looks very Jurassic Park-ish. But it's still a really cool design, in my opinion, as an inaccurate dinosaur figure, I guess, you could say. But, like I said before, and it also has the Jurassic Park stance, as well, when when we see um, the Jurassic Park Tyrannosaurus from the first film roaring in triumph again when they attack when it attacked the um, the final Velociraptor, it was you know it's pretty cool. I like how its jaws like open and open and close. That's what in most theropod figures from Papo, and even like some theropod figures in general, not just Papo, but their mouths, you know, sometimes they open and close, depending on the figure, of course. And uh, yeah, like I can't believe this. Like, I got this figure in Hob Hobby Lobby at the time, and uh, yeah. Of course, that this figure is popular in like books. Um, also, figures at the, like, other figure companies, like, for example, back in the day, the Animal Planet, um, the Animal Planet toys, like, you see, like, a picture of the Papo Tyrannosaurus Rex in it, um, which I have to say that it's kind of lazy writing, but I guess they want to entertain. I mean, it's not just the Pe Papo Tyrannosaurus, they also use the Papo Triceratops and whatnot and uh yeah um but yeah and i also do like the jurassic park like it has the the male tyrannosaurus rex um paint color it like it's like a greenish like color because obviously the males in the franchise are are green which i mean i don't have a problem because we don't know what color Tyrannosaurus was like. Maybe males were green and females were brown. But who knows. <laughs> and I also have the brown version. But I will do a review of it in the future though. But yeah. Um, yeah like I can't believe. Like I can't believe I still have this figure. Like I really love it so bad. I It's still like pretty cool. Like and obviously like these were. Like, I thought that this was Jurassic Park, but no, this is not Jurassic Park. It's a whole completely company. Even though, like I said before, they are Jurassic Park. Um, they look like Jurassic Park, but they're not supposed to be Jurassic Park, if that makes any sense. But, yeah. Um, I will, you know, I will still love this figure, though. I mean, as for, like, figure-wise, like, it, like, it's not my favorite Tyrannosaurus Rex figure, but it's probably maybe my favorite inaccurate Tyrannosaurus Rex figure, I guess you could say, you know, if that makes any sense. But as for, like, Tyrannosaurus Rex overall, it's not even close. Because there's other figures that took over the spotlight. Um, Papo, the Rebor, Kiss and Tusk figures, Beasts of the Mesozoic, 
all these other figure companies are better than the Papo is. But Papo in general, at least they're trying to get things better. Who knows, maybe they'll bring back a Tyrannosaurus Rex, but I doubt it. Anyways, do you guys have do you guys like this toy? Do you guys have this figure? Um and let me know in the comments.